Hi, I'm Adam with Wings and Wheels, and today I'm going to be talking about Aerox Aviation Oxygen Systems, cannulas, and face masks. Both of these items are essential for supplemental oxygen use. While being similar, these items have their own unique uses in different situations. The main difference between the cannula and the full face mask is the altitudes they are rated for. Aerox cannulas are rated for up to 18,000 feet MSL, perfect when flying at mid to high altitudes for an extended period of time. The Aerox face masks are rated for up to 25,000 feet MSL. This is perfect if you are flying in an area with a wave window and want to climb to extreme altitudes. Aerox cannulas come in two different versions, standard and conserving, with the conserving cannula having the option to come with a flow meter. The OxyPro conserving cannula has the option for two different cannula styles, those being the mustache and the pendant. Some pilots might prefer the pendant over the mustache because of its lightweight and convenience. While not being as light, the mustache offers maximum comfort over other designs because of its soft nasal prongs. The standard cannula is lightweight, inexpensive, and does not interfere with headsets. The conserving cannula is a device that can provide savings in oxygen by up to 75%. It will increase oxygen duration by up to eight times compared to non-altitude compensated systems using a standard cannula or face mask. We also have the option to add a flow meter to your conserving cannula that's going to allow you to adjust the oxygen flow depending on your altitude. The flow meter can plug right into your cylinder or built-in oxygen system. On these cannulas, you have the option to have the valve integrated into the flow meter or have the valve at the regulator. Whether you have a conserving or a standard cannula, it needs to be put on correctly for it to work effectively. To properly wear a cannula, uncoil the tubing completely, and in the case of the pendant style cannula, hold the device so that the front of the pendant is facing away from you. Place the prongs in your nose, extend the tubing around your cheekbones, and place the tubing around your ears. Attach the tubing clip to join both sides of the cannula tubing. Slide the clip upwards beneath your chin to hold the tubing in place. From there, you can connect the cannula to your oxygen system. Cannulas are an amazing option for supplemental oxygen, but if you want to soar above 18,000 feet, you're going to want a face mask. Aerox has three different types of masks that you can choose from, those being the clear, blue, and diluter demand mask. The clear masks are lightweight and most affordable of the mask options. You can get these masks including a full custom assembly for your system, or you can just get the standalone mask. The blue masks are a step up from the clear. Being a little higher in price, they deliver oxygen more efficiently and they're higher quality. Same as the clear masks, you can get the blue mask as a standalone or including a full custom assembly. You can also get the blue mask to include a microphone. Both the clear and blue mask are rated for up to 25,000 feet, but our highest quality mask, the diluter demand mask, is rated for up to 40,000 feet MSL. This mask delivers oxygen with extreme efficiency to the user and has special features such as a silicone face piece for maximum comfort and an electrical microphone. You can pair this mask with an integrated onboard system or a portable bottle for a standalone emergency kit. Just like the cannula, the face mask needs to be put on properly for it to work effectively. To properly put on one of the face masks, First, place the mask over your face, covering both your nose and your mouth. The mask is elongated and should fit on the bridge of your nose and under your chin. Pass the strap over your head and adjust for comfort and fit. The mask may fit better and be more comfortable if the strap is on your neck and below your ears. Adjust the metal nose strip until the mask fits snugly over the bridge of your nose. No matter what mask you decide to choose, all of them are high quality and will satisfy your oxygen needs. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to see more videos like this, let me know down in the comments below. I've linked our website in the description if you want to learn more about Aerox products. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.